Possible new charges for disgraced former IMF chief Dominique Strauss-Kahn, the man once famously accused of sexually assaulting a New York hotel maid last year, may be charged for another alleged assault in 2010. France 24 explains. Uh, judges investigating the various uh, cases of an alleged prostitution ring, but they're investigating now possible rape, which uh, only adds to a th ever thickening file. Strauss Kahn is accused of pimping, money laundering, and fraud, but a testimony from one of the women working at Strauss Kahn's sex parties described an incident prosecutors referred to as gang rape. WJLA explains. Authorities are investigating if Strauss Kahn raped a woman here at the W Hotel in Washington. Investigators say new evidence suggests the financier sexually assaulted a Belgian prostitute at a sex party at the hotel. The woman says Strauss Kahn pinned her down and performed sex acts on her against her will. But while the allegations are serious, the media responded with a yawn. Like a writer for Jezebel, who called the story the world's least surprising gang rape accusation. And a writer for New York Magazine, who, in a bit of an understatement, introduced Strauss Kahn as a lecherous scandal magnet. A writer for the Atlantic Wire defends the media's collective shrug, saying it's just too hard to keep track of the appalling things Strauss Kahn is accused of. Forgive us, but we've lost count of who DSK has allegedly sexually assaulted, allegedly sexually assaulted but had charges dismissed, allegedly sexually assaulted but statute of limitations had passed, Oh, and there's his current alleged pimping probe, too. But not all of the ire was directed at DSK. Some of it was directed at the coverage itself. A writer for the American Prospect took issue with the New York Times' headline, New Sex Allegations Against Strauss Kahn. Sexual assault isn't a sex allegation. It's a rape allegation. No one cares if DSK is alleged to have had sex. What we care about is whether he assaulted someone, sexually or otherwise. If someone is arrested for allegedly breaking into a jewelry store and stealing a Rolex, we don't call it shopping allegation. For Newsy, I'm Christian Bryan. Multiple sources, the real story.